messing around. Mm. We, we might see the snake ditto. I would be excited to see the snake ditto. That's double the snake action on the screen. I, that's a character I want to see more of. And that's what we're going to get. <gasps> snake dittos. Can we please go to, you know, I know I know we said we don't have Shadow, but we do have Shadow Moses Island in this game. <laughs> Why can't we go to Shadow Moses Island? My dream go came true, Edmund. <laughs> dittos. Dittos. Snake dittos, yeah. You are foretelling the, the bracket for, uh, right now. So heck, we're going to kick off Pussy Poo versus Heavy. And this is Pokemon Stadium 2 with Angel Life and Edmund on the mic. All right, you guys. And I'm excited to see some explosions happening. This is going to feel like a Michael Bay movie right now. Oh, my God. Just sure. explosions yeah, happening like, left and right. It's like all, the, like all the Transformer movies in one. Oh, my God. <laughs> Only 3% heavy already completely destroying Moosey Poo on this first stock. You don't understand oh. where we're oh, from, Santa Clarita. Yeah. Heavy is the pocket oh. god. Oh, I've heard, I've heard of a lot about Heavy for sure. It's uh, unfortunately, we, oh, he's got the sticky on him. I saw that. He's gonna want to be careful about how he's playing on the platforms. Wow, and God for a reason too, because look at this. He's just putting on the hurt. Oh, the shield is so small. Oh, he's able to sneak that forward tilt in. The dash attack catching him. Heavy only at twenty percent on this first stock still. This man is untouchable. Untouchable this match, and he recovers from so high too. You'd think that um, he would have some punish coming down, but really he's just so strategic yeah. about where he lands. Yeah, the thing about Snake is that he, he tends to recover high in most matchups. I don't know about the Snake matchup, but he recovers high um, and use, has to use his B reverse grenades and his uh, C4 to kind of mix up his recovery. Uh, but a lot of player, a lot of characters can edge guard him pretty, uh, pretty well. The Cipher has an uh, eight percent uh, armor, so if if you can hit him with a move that does more than eight percent, it'll just break. And Snake is sitting duck; he's gonna die. But Heavy has yet to die in this game, and uh, Moosey Poo already on his last life at eighty-two percent. Wow! And great Putting use. Out the Nikita, it's gonna catch him. Oh my God! He's dead. Yep, star KO off the top, and that's going to wow. be a three stock coming out from Heavy. Wow. Yeah. Oh, oh man. man. I don't know. I'm going to give a little bit of history here, but Heavy here, um, we come out from the Santa Clarita area, mm -hmm. and he came and joined our local for the first time uh, a little while ago, maybe about a month ago, and he was able to get a, a set off of Void during the grand finals. It oh, was wow. really impressive. So um, th those two boys, like they, they hash it out all the time. All the time, if you watch Void streams, um, he's always playing with heavy. Yeah, yeah, I've definitely seen him on Void streams uh, here and there. But uh, yeah, heavy, he's quite a heavy hitter, <laughs> if I say so myself. And I know he's well respected in, in SoCal as well. This is, uh, he's, he's a player, San Clarita is like kind of far, so it's like, you don't get to see him too much at like the MSN, the Wednesday Night Fights, but... Oh yeah, but I'll be bringing him to Prime Saga too. There we go, so we get to see more of this action. And we're gonna get game number two on Battlefield Moosey Poo making the switch to Roy. Roy, uh, I, I guess, I mean, most players, you know, you wanted to see the Dittos, but most players don't like playing Dittos, so maybe this is just a, a better comfort pick here. Yes. Oh my god, what a conversion off of the C4 into the up air. A perfect stock coming out from Heavy, who has yet to take any damage. You know, maybe Roy was a good pick here because I, I think that, yeah, with the dittos, it is a little bit tougher, right? And uh, two zoner characters, look at him. He's able to put out the up B here and put on some really good damage. The up smashes here coming out by the ledge, forcing a quick uh, reaction from Moosey Poo. It's such a good tool by the ledge there. You can um, So the longer you charge an up smash, uh, it doesn't actually increase the knockback. It actually just... Uh, uh, just damage. Changes, adjusts the height that the, mm. the actual mortar like goes up. So uh, you can you know do a slight charged one and a fully charged one so that the two mortars land at different times. I so see. it covers more options that way. And uh, yeah, that's that's what part of what makes Snake such a great ledge trapper. Uh-oh. See, he's and he can really recover low. from so Ooh. low. Did you see that? He yeah. threw on the sword on him, but man, Snake has got some hands of steel or something because yeah. he doesn't let go of it, that recovery. It's that armor, as I mentioned earlier, um, that forward air, I guess, uh, um, Roy's forward air doesn't do enough damage to break through the armor, but Heavy also covering his bases and the directional air dodging to the ledge before uh, that as well, so he's able to make it. Okay. 
counter, beating up the down air or the up airs, but Lucy Poo yet to find a stock. He's gonna go for the Hail Mary up B. Ooh. Oh, he's gone. Yep. Sends at a low angle, and he's not gonna be able to make it back heavy with the quickest. I mean.